Well, the last time Roman Candle Pizza was on the morning blend, we gave them a challenge. We said to them, hey, bring us the guy who tosses the pizza because we want to know what it's like <laughs> to toss a pie. And we are here now with Brewer Stouffer. He is with Roman Candle Pizza located in Whitefish Bay. His pizza tosser is Cam. So this guy knows what he's doing? Cam does. Cam's been with our company for... Uh, Almost six years, he moved from Madison to open the Whitefish Bay store a year ago, and now he's uh, loving Walker's Point. That's oh, where he really? and his, is that where and his girlfriend living? live. That's where oh, I live, that's yeah. awesome. Okay, so what goes into being a good pizza tosser? Practice. Just, I've that's tossed it? thousands and thousands of pizzas at this point, and I can you know, do it blindfolded. Do you this. dream about tossing pizzas and them <laughs> landing on the floor? Usually I dream about a little more drama than that. <laughs> more drama. More drama more than drama. The pizza sort of spins Every, off into a new city. Wire and usually the pizza tossing, it, I can do that in my That's sleep. something you can control. Okay, so you brought some aprons for us, right? We, we did. because we put I, them on? If I remember the challenge correctly, you All both right. wanted to learn how to toss pizzas. Okay, we only have a minute and a half, so we got to get tossed in here. For the record, I was not a part of this you challenge. You were not part of the challenge. Okay. I'm a good sport. <laughs> Sylvia's like, I didn't s sign up for this. Well, we teach a lot of we teach a lot of kids how to do this when they come in for birthday parties. So okay. I'm pretty sure anyone can do it at this point. All right. Okay. So All right, best awesome. way to start, we're gonna put your hands up, kind of like you're driving a car. Okay. Kind of two, right? Sounds good. And we're just gonna drape it right over top. We're gonna okay. use one pivot. Do I need flour on my hands? No. Oh, okay. You're All right. So you kind of like a, hold it loosely. Yep. And okay. then one one hand's a pivot, and you just. Oh, okay. Whoa, you want to try it first? Sure. All right, go ahead. Sure, she makes me right. do it. <laughs> now, all, all, all the pizza starts out. What if you drop out? it on the floor? Will you be upset? Hey. Oh, oh, no, no that's way part of Nice job. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty good. I'm impressed. I'm not going to make any pizza with these, right. so we can drop them on We're the floor. We're okay. All right. You can throw them and do whatever oh, you want with them. Okay. Hey, look at that. Wow. You know what? If, we, if they land on our heads like Lucille Ball, we can just kind of do the eye thing and let, let our eyes Check this out. I'm going to try to get some So what, what you want to do is, is as you work huh? the dough, you want to actually stretch it a little bit. Oh, That's okay. what the master pizza maker does. Okay. And what that does is it sort of gives a nice well, even yeah, balance. Right. Right. Okay. Oh, no. She went through hers. I'm broken. That, that That's happens not good, all the right? time. Okay. I'll just glue it together there. Whoa. There we go. Okay. No problem. It's all back together. I love it. Look at it. No one saw nothing. We actually do. see you do it. So I just Cam's the master. Whoa! Wow! Check that out. And, and notice his dough days. ball started as, as one of these just, just a short time ago. Okay. So we slap out the dough, you press it out, and now Cam's able to, you to get a lot of. It's a soft touch. Soft yeah, touch. Soft touch. Soft touch. Soft now, touch. Your girlfriend said that too, didn't Whoa. she? You That's what she said. Oh, I like you. <laughs> <laughs> That's Rebecca, by the way. She's awesome. Just kidding. So, okay, let's talk about, because there's a certain kind of pizza I want to talk about. It's the algo malo. So Why you take you one of these dough balls. Algo malo. That's Spanish for something bad. Well, oh, it is? a lot of yeah. people don't Maybe like beets. And Kitchen. that's where we oh. came from. We, we hang out with a lot of restaurant people, and beets have sort of a weird rap. I think Maria, who's going to be on a little bit, would agree with that. So some people <laughs> think of, of, of beets as kind of weird. So we have a pizza that features beets walnuts, uh, blue cheese, and we top it with arugula. And so it's kind of a set of ingredients that a lot of people are like, you put that on a pizza, but it's phenomenal. It's got a, some tanginess, some saltiness, and it's really good for you as well. So it that sounds awesome. fantastic. So the beets are a, a little bad, some people think, but we think they're speaking a lot of, delicious. Speaking of bad but good, you have craft cocktails too, right? I don't know if a lot of we, people think of pizza joints as having craft craft cocktails. You know, Cam sort of pioneered this program, but uh, Cam, tell us about what we have this. It's our rum, it's our oh, fall rum punch. and we're almost out of time, so should I pour it? If pour you it. Want. All right. So it's going to be sweet. It's kind of a, an alcoholic of sorts. Got multiple kinds of rum, Roaring Dan's from uh, Great Lakes Distillery just down the road. Um, nice. And a little lemon juice and some rosemary in there. And All we, right, we so always yeah. have a cocktail kegged up, so we literally just pour it out. Give it cheers, a sip. Tell us what you think. Happy holidays. Happy, Happy holidays. holidays. And in the holiday spirit for the next uh, 11 days, as part of our 12 days of Christmas, we're donating three meals to Second Harvest for every large specialty pizza ordered. So maybe order a Algamala or something else from the Roman Candle, and we'll donate three meals to uh, awesome. for the next 12 days. We're trying to trying to raise about 3,000 meals. Let's see That's if we can do That's fantastic. I had a friend it's who delicious. just had, this is fantastic, cool. a loss in her family. I ordered pizzas and salad and breadsticks from you guys. See, <laughs> Brewer? I, love I got you Molly. covered, Thank and she you. was very happy. So oh, thanks, cool. you guys. Yeah, here's the information so that you can take advantage of everything delicious they have at Roman Candle Pizza. They're located on East Silver Spring Drive. They do a great job with their delivery. They also have craft cocktails, and be sure to ask for the Algo Malo Pizza when you call. Here's the phone number 414 964 
3000 and the website to visit is theromancandle.com. Awesome. That was so Thank fun. Thank you so much. Well, this is great. Thank you. Thanks for that. It was fantastic. So